There are four standard reports available in every download of ReadyShipper along the left side of the screen under the Reports section. Two of the reports are for pre-shipping and two of the reports are for post-shipping. As you can see here on the main screen, I've left two orders unshipped and have four orders that have shipped. We're going to go through the pre-shipping reports first. The order report is designed to create one clean list of each shipment that has to go out with all the details of that shipment. Now to create that report, you can select a certain order date range or order number range, or you can simply say include all unarchived orders, all orders, or just selected orders. Once you've made your choice, simply click apply and the report will be generated for you. As you can see, here are our two unshipped shipments with the customer's name, address, the shipping method, the individual products in each order, and the number of boxes that you'll need to fulfill them. You can then print that, save it as a PDF, or export that information to a CSV file. The other pre-shipping report is the pick report. Again, the same options apply. You can use the order date range, order number range. You can also select all unshipped orders or just selected unshipped orders, and then click apply. The pick report is going to break down what products you need to fulfill all your orders that day. As you can see here, I'm going to need six orange widgets and two red widgets. The two post shipping reports are the carrier report and the ship manifest report. The carrier report can again be broken down by a ship date range or an order number range. You can also tell it to include archived orders if you'd like. You have the option then to choose a bar chart or a pie chart and then group them by carrier. Once you've made your choice, again simply click apply and the report will be created for you. As you can see here, we have one FedEx shipment, two USPS shipments, and one UPS shipment. The total cost of each has been detailed. The final report is the ship manifest report. Again, same options to select a certain date range or order number range and to include all unarchived orders, all orders, or just selected orders. Once you've made your selection, again, click apply and you now have a report of all the shipments that went out that day with their order number, customer name, shipping address, shipping method, the products in those orders, and the tracking number for that shipment. As you can see, these standard reports can certainly help your process both before shipping and after shipping. We do offer more robust reporting options through our custom CSV export and in our new Ready Cloud.